Welcome to Kermit Uncut. I've got a question for you, and it's this. What does the word final mean? I mean, it means an end, right? It means an end point. It means things stopping. The reason I ask is because this morning, I went to a screening of Resident Evil, the final chapter, which I actually rather enjoyed. I mean, I liked Mirio Vich's character in it. I thought the, you know, the, the visuals were kind of quite exciting. And actually, in terms of Paul W.S. Anderson's film career, it's surprisingly coherent. However, as I was going in, I bumped into Kim Newman, who's a colleague and a friend. And Kim said, can you remember what had happened at the end of the last film? I think we're on number six now. And I said, to be honest with you, I can't. But it's okay because this is the final chapter, right? This is the end. This will bring everything together so it'll make sense. And Kim said, yeah, when was the last time the word final meant something was actually finishing? And he said the example that sprung to mind was, look at Star Trek, The Final Frontier. You know, the movie in which William Shatner goes into space and beats up God in heaven. I mean, that wasn't the end of anything. In fact, it was the beginning of a whole new generation and a whole new franchise. We had loads and loads of movies after that. Or think about A Nightmare on Elm Street. A Nightmare on Elm Street, we had Freddy's Dead, after which we had Freddy vs. Jason and the remake of Nightmare on Elm Street. Freddy wasn't dead. He wasn't going anywhere at all. In fact, Wes Craven's new nightmare turned out to be really exciting, really intelligent. I was kind of quite glad that the Nightmare on Elm Street series hadn't entirely finished. Or what about the Omen trilogy? The Omen, first film, then Damien, Omen 2. Incidentally, I went to school with John and Scott Taylor. I mentioned it only in passing. And then the third one, The Final Conflict, a film which bizarrely seems oddly prescient in the current political climate. However, it has the word final in it because it wasn't final at all. A few years later, we had Omen for The Awakening. It's a weird story about there was a child, there was fetus paparitious, and somehow the genetics had carried on and the story wasn't going anywhere. Plus, the spin-off novels continued. The fact of the matter is that when people say final, they don't mean final at all. They just mean, no, really, you know, as in the case of the Freddy movie, they said, we saved the best for last, but we're actually not finishing. So, as far as I'm concerned, the word final in the dictionary shouldn't mean end. The word final should mean we're carrying on, we're just going to go our separate ways for a while, make our individual solo albums, and then come back for a massive Hell Freezes Over reunion tour. I look forward to the next Resident Evil movie. <laughs>